today's going to be one of the best shows that we got because um, o o over the weekend Gary did an appearance with the Gary and and you know Howard was you know grilling him about it all week. You better not lose the Gary You better not lose it. So me and some of my friends went to his appearance and stole the Gary Gary's been calling me all weekend. He's, he's, he's flipping. He thinks it's gone. He doesn't know what to do. So this is going to be really funny. Uh, it's, this is probably is you know I can't, I, you know, I, can't uh, I can't wait to see what happens. Baba Booey, what is your problem? What, tell me what is ailing you. B uh, Baba Booey... Uh, he must be nervous. He's already licked those teeth twice. <laughs> Are you licking those teeth? <laughs> Just throw a bucket of water on me. <laughs> Fred, get the... I think you better get the Gary Puppet for this one uh, and start licking its teeth. we got to get to move its tongue. Yes, we got to get Gary Puppet a tongue. Yeah. What is your problem? Okay, I'm really, really nervous, so you got to have a little pity on me. You know, like when a kid comes to his father and he did something wrong? I'm sure it wasn't you're that no bad. You're kid, you're a grown man. Fred, don't go anywhere. <laughs> like when a kid... The, um, the Gary Puppet has been abducted. Oh, stop And I know it's, it. somebody stole the puppet on Saturday. But I have a plate number of the car that took it. Are you serious? I'm very serious. You I'm not, I'm not kidding. Are you kidding? I'm not we kidding. You take the puppet. Wait, is a whole, excuse me. I want to say something. Okay. He's kidding. I'm not kidding. I think that you guys set me up, but I really believe oh, it. Oh, I set you up. I think that you guys set me up. Uh, first of all, number one, I did not set you up. Number mm -hmm. two, what did I tell you about taking the Gary puppet on an appearance? To keep, a, keep an eye on it. So how did he comes away? to me. He comes to me and he says, "Hey, Howard. Hey, Wolf. I want it. Did I tell you I love the Gary Puppet more than I love any person on this planet? Yes, you did. That I love the Gary Puppet more than my wife and family. You probably yes, you did say that. You it, did say definitely that. more than you. Definitely more. <laughs> than definitely me. more than the Gary Puppet is a superstar <laughs> on on E. Yes. It, and and people on the radio like the Gary Puppet. Go figure that one out. That's like Charlie McCarthy being I a know, star. I know. I never radio. understood how that worked, but it's working here. How again. did you lose it? How could you do that? Uh, How well, do you lose the Gary wait a puppet? Let me find out what the situation was. It was Saturday? Yes. And why did I, well, how would I set you up? I don't know. We don't even know where you were. Where were you? Where, oh, you, you guys know where I was. I, I mean, have it was no an appearance. idea. It's not you like you know. Where were you? I was at an appearance in Little Falls, New Jersey. And where is the Gary puppet now? Gone. Someone stole it. Yes. You're not kidding. But how no, did it get out of your sight? Why weren't you touching the Gary puppet at all times? Because the owner of the store, the owners of the store, wanted me to look at something, and they said they would watch it while I was gone for about two seconds. <laughs> what? He's, not, he's kidding. I'm not kidding. The ah, Gary puppet is gone. Yes, it's gone. Then you better get on Fred's lap. <laughs> get me a cane. <laughs> I didn't tell anybody or was in cahoots with anyone. Why would the owners... And but of owners course of somebody would want to steal no, it. No, 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 no. But why would the owners of the store need to lure Gary away... What yeah. did they need to show you? What did they show you? He needed to show me the sound system in his car. Why? It was an it audio sound? store. Ooh. Huh. And you just left the Gary Puppet like sitting in a bag? No, it was sitting behind the counter. It was behind... All right, let me get this straight. You yeah, go you, I have an eyewitness on the phone. An eyewitness who also get me, who also managed to get me the plate number of the car. That Excellent. Took it. Hello. Hi. Hey. This is Walt. Did you call the cops? Not yet. Well, it's a kidnapping. Oh, the Gary Puppet could be in another state by now. Yes, yeah, what I'm saying. The Gary Puppet could be gone. <laughs> Hello? Hi. That Gary Puppet, first of all, is expensive. Yeah. And I don't want a, I don't want a different Gary Puppet. I like that one. Well, the owner of the store is already willing to, uh, to pay for you know, one to be made. Oh, he is? Yes. Yeah, I but how long is it going to take? Probably take a couple of weeks. And what are we supposed oh. to do? Oh, boy. Gary, from now on, man, do me a favor. If someone hires you for an appearance, right. go yourself. Don't take the Gary Puppet. I, well, Don't take anything of mine. That's my property I lent you. I tr entrusted you with my property. I but, had a feeling. Why did you tell him he could do it? I told him because I thought he was responsible, but that's a, that's the uh, second mistake I made. Yes? You were a witness? Yeah. Did you see the person who stole it? Uh, basically, but I got to tell you. You, say, you know that someone stole it? I got to tell you. What? Watching the people around that place was like being at a party where the joke's on the one person and everybody else is laughing their ass off behind your back. So you're saying that there, were, there was more than one person in on it? Uh, well, I Everyone saw it, nobody... on it, but they were all told during it. What are you mm. talking about? Well, I just happened to be done taking pictures of Gary and, and the puppet. So did you snap a picture of the guy? Actually, <laughs> I left the camera with somebody out front. But I walked around. Oh, uh, please. Please. Uh, why are you hanging up on what? him? Uh, 
Yeah, I don't even where, know what he he's talking about. He doesn't even have a picture about. of it. So he's, he saw the guys do it. He saw the car. He saw the faces. So, so the, you have the his number, number, I assume. Yeah. Yeah, got the license plate so number. So where is everything. the plate number then? I got it in my pocket. So they when call the cops. When are you going to report it? When are you going to report this thing? Why did you just hang up on that guy? So because quick? he's full of crap. About I asked what? him if he. I asked him if he had the um, the picture of him. He goes, I, "My camera got stolen." You believe? No, he didn't him? say his camera no, his got camera stolen. His camera was he outside. He said he left it up front. Why are you so quick to hang uh, up on him? I just don't know. He had a lot. He had a lot. Why are you say? accusing me of this? You stole my puppet. I'm not accusing you of anything. I love that friggin' puppet. The puppet's great on the... Do me a favor, Gary. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah. Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye. I'll see you later. Yeah. It's a big joke. Not a big joke. It's a big joke. joke to everyone but me. He's sitting there accusing me. Get the guy on the phone, then. Why am I hanging up on the guy? And he gives me a big smirk. He, I don't know what anybody's talking about. A big about. toothy smirk. I can't figure out what happened. Because he thinks that I'm in on it. Oh. What's going on, John? We want to talk to a guy who uh, was at the appearance when... Yeah. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Howard. Yeah. And it was horrible. Did you see the guy who took it? Well, I had just got there right when it happened. I walked in, and I, there was, of course, there was a big crowd for Gary, about seven people. And I went in the back, and I saw Gary in the back, and I've never seen a whiter face in my life. Looked like a big, looked like a mime almost. <laughs> oh, looked my. like a mime with a mouthful of green chiclets. <laughs> oh. But anyway, <laughs> let me tell you, the sweat was dripping off him. <laughs> he looked like I'd never seen anybody look that sick. Hey, if somebody has vomit. the Gary puppet, would you call in and give it back? I would appreciate it. No questions asked. You could just see the dread. He didn't want Monday to come at all. If anybody is listening to this program and has possession of the Gary puppet... Yeah, it's all right to yank Gary around, but that's our puppet. Yeah, we want our puppet back. If you could just call in and give us the puppet back, we'd appreciate it. We don't ask you for much. Because Toothy over there is giving me um, weird looks. Uh, why'd you hang up on that guy? Why'd you hang up on that guy? Because I'm not going to sit and listen to some guy who tells me his camera is up front. He didn't see anything. Just wants to be on the air. He wants to be on the air. But Toothy is too stupid to see that. Huh. Did you see the guy who took it? I told you I got there right when it happened, so I didn't see anybody oh. who was there. But uh, Gary's reaction was just amazing. He was on the side of the building holding his hands, and he just was walking all around. You could, he just felt bad for him for a second until I got in my car and started cracking up. I know, it does seem kind of dumb. It's all it over sounds... a puppet, but the puppet's really expensive, and oh, the puppet's really very famous. It sounds like he was watching O.J. in the van. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> He was looking up in the air. I guess he was looking for a beam so he could throw a rope. I don't mind. You know what? I'm not mad at Gary for the puppet being taken. I'm, although I am. I'm mad on well, one yeah. level. But, I mean, what, what? he's coming in here giving me, like, a big stupid grin. Like, I'm supposed to be happy about this. He certainly wasn't grinning that day, I'll tell you that much. He was hurting. I'm not giving you I don't grin. get you, man. No, I'm not. It's, I'm just... You I, lose my possessions, and then I'm supposed to sit there and take it? The guy said he didn't even have a picture of him. Yeah, but so so what are you talking about? So get the license plate and call the cops. What are you waiting yeah, for? Yeah, but you didn't even ask the guy all the stuff that he did see. Howard, you want to hear I assumed he, one? Th I assumed he didn't he see what this done. guy didn't see anything. This guy wasn't even there. This guy, that other guy saw somebody bring it out the back that probably worked So put him back the, on. That probably worked put him back the place. On. All right. Huh. John. Yeah. You mean the people you were working for? So took you think the someone? I don't know. I, I I shouldn't say. But I like how you're accusing everyone of taking the puppet. Well, now. let's Howard. It's not inconceivable. Just think about it. Think about it. That if someone who me. worked there. No, it's not inconceivable that you guys would want to pull up. Just think about it. I what, didn't would, do anything. Would it be I don't have anything to We've do with this. We've tried to get Jackie's a fake daughter. We've pulled a practical joke on everybody on the show. It's not inconceivable that you guys, this would be the ultimate uh, practical Gary, joke to pull Gary, on me. I'll tell you something. Why I don't we have the Gary puppet here for the show today? Why I don't wish. We just because come because in it wouldn't be and, funny and yet. I it wish. Out. It's not funny I until wish. you torment me for two or Excuse three days. Excuse me. I wish. I wish mm -hmm. I had been smart enough to steal the Gary puppet. Because then we'd have it. I was promoting this appearance for two weeks. I could almost hear the words coming out of Jackie's lips. I got a great idea. Let's steal the puppet. I'm just saying, it's not inconceivable. No, it's not good. the case. Did you did you have anything to do with this? No, me? No. No, Jackie. What am I going to John, come in here. But, I mean, it's not inconceivable. I don't understand why you left the puppet there. I have an you because, because, because the what, people there's so many people there. Because the but people that I'm, were running, I asked you to watch the Because the people that were running the store said they'd watch it. I was gone for two seconds. What? Get that guy back. When am I going to fire you? He's always you? delegating. What, what? Somebody yeah, tells him to yeah. take care of the puppet. I say to Gary, watch the friggin' puppet. So what does he do? He gets there. And leaves it. And he, he let, tells someone else to watch the puppet. Yeah. Why leave it? The thing weighs two pounds. It was behind a counter with people that worked at the store. Then they claimed they didn't see anything. You know what I mean? 
Yeah, they're claiming that because they don't want to be responsible. Then, then the guy who took it. But that's not his responsibility. The guy who you stored were supposed it. to keep the puppet with you. You're right. So just keep. Why don't you bring the puppet with you when you went to look at the guy's car? What was the big deal? Did he make a whole issue of it? Yeah. Well, yeah. He's like, you got to come out and see my car. It'll take two seconds. Come on. He just like sort of tugging me. Come on. We'll be two seconds. Come on. You know what I mean? So just bring the puppet with you. I know, I, but like I said, it was behind the counter. Somebody was watching. It was going to be a second. You know how it happens. If we had given you 500 gold bars, you would have left them with strangers. Right. No, I wouldn't. No, people have. you don't know. Yeah. that's. A, if I gave him magic beans, like in Jack and the Magic <laughs> Beanstalk, toothy over here. <laughs> Listen, man, I, the thing I... I if the puppet's replaceable, even though now we've got to wait three or four weeks mm-hmm. for a puppet to be made. Is, is that how long it takes? Probably, yeah. The, the puppet's replaceable. What I, what my trust has been betrayed here. I've said to you, hold on. If you're going to take a puppet, I, I hold admit, on to it. No, I admit that. I, gosh, I mean, I don't know what to say. I mean, I, I admit that what I did was stupid and wrong. It is stupid. Apologize. And I'd like to apologize to Jackie's wife, Nancy. Yeah. I hope your wife never leaves you with a baby. Yeah. Uh, I'll just put it behind the counter here. <laughs> here, would you watch this for me? <laughs> Howard, the place had no surveillance cameras either. Actually, That's not true. Oh, it does. did happen, but they weren't on. They so weren't you know, on. The guy, great yeah, the guy said they weren't on. Sort of seems odd. With, with Why wouldn't they be on? Because they don't put them on during, during the day. A, during a, uh, an appearance is the best time to put it on. People lift stuff all the time. Was the guy's stereo cool? I mean, what was the match? Yeah, I was know. it a great stereo? Yeah, it was a, it was a Sony mini disc player with a 10 CD changer inside Gee, of a Porsche. Oh boy. So it was worth it. Yeah, it was worth my uh, yeah, puppet Yeah, looking being at stolen. it really makes a big difference. What is his stuttering, John? This guy claims he has the puppet. All right. Hey, I got to hang up on you, dude. All right, bud. All right. Hello? Do you have the puppet? I've got the puppet, and I'm holding it hostage. I want $1,000, and if I don't, I'm going to start sending you little body parts of this uh, puppet. <laughs> this piece by piece. You don't I, have the puppet. I've got the puppet. I'll tell you what, if you have the puppet... Yeah? Make it talk. <laughs> Let me talk to the puppet. The puppet is bound and gagged in a chair. I'm not Let me talk, talk to the, the puppet. puppet. Let I'll me... tell you what I'll do. I'll send you a picture of the puppet with today's Asbury Park Press and the Philadelphia Inquirer with the same date on it. <laughs> All right. Then the that's the All right. Oh, hold on. Wait, wait, wait a second. second. Wait a second. Wait a second. He Let's... doesn't have the puppet. How I did... got the puppet. A okay. guy came out of the store Why don't you tell with me? Jersey plates, and I was there from Philadelphia. He said, look what I got, the Gary puppet. He flipped it to me, and I jumped into my car. So Gary's got so a wait, wait, license plate. You, wait, hold, hold on a second. You were just sitting in the back of the parking lot, and somebody threw you the puppet. You had no just, plan or anything. No plan whatsoever. I somebody was just, just threw you the puppet, and you took off with it. He just said, you hey. you need a plan to baffle you, Gary? He said, look what I have. All right, hold on a second. What was the Gary puppet wearing? Do you know what the Gary yes. puppet was wearing? All right. What was the Gary puppet wearing? What is it wearing? Is, what is the Gary what puppet wearing? Again? It changes outfits a lot. Yeah. Changes outfits a lot. What is the Gary puppet wearing right now? A pair of pants and a shirt on. What's on the shirt? What does the shirt say? What's the shirt say? What the hell is the shirt say? The Howard Stern show. Uh, Uh, You don't have the puppet. I'm telling you. Then what? Then what? Are you going to take the chance of me having the puppet? Because I'm going to start. I'm going to start sanding off a piece of an appendage of this puppet. Wait, that's unnecessary. Send us the picture. Don't harm him. I'm, I tell you, he's bound and gagged right now. Why don't you just look at the T-shirt and tell us what it is, and then I'll offer you a reward. Get it another. I, I've got yeah, the puppet. Exactly. I want a thousand dollars, and I'll meet you down at Rockefeller Center Plaza for, for the thousand. You don't have it. How about how about yeah. the guy on the phone who kind of sounds like he has it because he because he knows where Gary was. Hello, do you have the Gary puppet? I sure don't know what's in that clan. I got the puppet, Howard. Now how'd you get it? Yeah. How'd I get it? Yeah. You went outside, you left the puppet like a fool. You right. left it right there. And how'd you get it? I grabbed it, ran out the back door. Like a fool. Okay, now what That's a, what he is, is a fool. What did the back door look like? The back door, it even had a, uh, like a security thing across the back to set an alarm off. I went right out the back, it didn't even go off. Uh-huh. I ran out Is the that right? Door. That's true. What's, right. a, what's a t-shirt, what, what does a t-shirt say? Ta-ta Tusi. It says, it says uh, hi, boss. Is that what is it that was right? there? Yeah. Oh, oh you, you got really, it? You really have the Baba Booey puppet? Absolutely. Listen. Now, I, why did you take hold it? Hold it a second. What? I love that puppet more than anything. What's it worth, what to you, Howard? What do you want? What do you want? Video oh. half price? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> why would you take the Gary puppet? You know it has family and people who... Hey, let don't me, you love it on the show? I mean, you can't do anything with it. Let me speak to the Gary oh, puppet. I mean, people love that puppet. If he's there with you, let me speak to him. All right. Hey, Gary, why'd you leave me like that? That's him. <laughs> Gary Puppet, are you all right? Oh, wait a second. I have to, <laughs> hold on. You know what? I'll be back in a sure. second. Somebody left a ransom note. Hold on. i got to get that for you so I can show it to you. No, there's no ransom note. I there didn't was leave a, a ransom, ransom note, note left? I did, not, I did not leave a ransom note, Howard. What is he saying? A ransom note was left at the place? Um, 
I don't know what Gary's saying at all. He just ran out of the room and said there's a ransom note. Because why wouldn't he bring that to us You went to uh, go throw beginning? up. He went to throw up. <laughs> Wait a second. So that idiot leaves the puppet laying in the back there, and you just took it, and nobody even said anything. Howard, the guy said to him, I was, I was scoping the place. I heard, I heard, uh... I heard a guy say to him, hey, why don't you go outside and give out some prizes to the people? He goes, oh, okay, no problem. <laughs> he even, he, and just gets up and walks away from and the you're not, And you're not a professional thief or anything? No, not by, uh, no, not at all. <laughs> it was too easy. It so was this too guy easy. Was, he wasn't even planning on stealing it. It was just... No, it was there because he says Gary was asked to go outside and hand out stuff. Yeah. Exactly. You weren't asked to go out to the guy's car. He says... Well, yeah, I was asked to go and hand out stuff and go out to the guy's so car. So this guy really has it. He knows everything. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. If you really have it, send me a shoe. All right. Or send me his so hand. Yeah. Send me his pinky. Oh. Oh. <laughs> don't send him. Don't send him I, c- I can tell you what his pinky is made out of and everything. I can tell you everything about him. Don't hurt him. Well, well, what's he worth to you? Ah, oh, come on. You're not going to make us pay, are you? You just did that to Goofy well, and Gary. Uh, nah. And I do have your license plate number. No, nah, that wasn't my car. That's How do you right. know? What? How do you know? How do I know it wasn't my car? He yeah. wasn't driving his car. I know, car. I know who was driving. I, didn't, I wasn't driving my car. You give us the Gary puppet. And we won't turn in your friend. Yeah. You nah, uh, you could turn him in. That's all right. <laughs> but he'll turn you in. And you know, the Gary puppet is worth $600, so that is a felony. Oh, that's all right. I'm not worried about that. Well, Gary will pay you for the puppet. Oh, yeah? I will. Well, what do you... What do you want? I'll pay you the $600 it's worth. Oh, come on. It's worth more than the value. It's worth more than that. What it costs to make. What that's about a Gary celebrity? Puppet. People love that puppet. <laughs> you can't have show my friends. They're loving the puppet. They're ready to buy it off me. Oh, man. See, this guy keeps showing it around. It's yeah, good. everybody's touching the Gary puppet. No, I didn't try. You it's know what? I can't believe the position I'm in that I now... One of my, my Gary puppet is being held for ransom. Yeah. <laughs> what did you I, make at that appearance? What did they pay you there? Well, I'm not going to say on the air, but I'll be willing to turn that... We can talk about it off the air, and I will be willing to turn did that... Did you make more than two grand? No. Did you make 1500 Somewhere around that area. Somewhere between fifteen hundred and two hundred. Is that good grand? for you, sir? Would you take no, that for the Gary Puppet? Gotta be worse about at least two thousand, about two thousand bucks at least. All right, Gary will give you two thousand bucks. I have people are willing to pay me since it's now that they actually know that's the actual Gary Pup because they were a little oh, skeptical. Man. They're actually you know willing to pay me that much money. All I do want to say, Howard, is even though it'll take two or three weeks, you know there were a couple of modifications you wanted to make on that puppet for two thousand dollars. You can I can have a better one made. And how do you feel? I don't know how I feel about the original Gary puppet I feel, being out there. I feel terrible about it being that out there. That is my puppet. And he'll be doing shows. And not only that, who knows what he'll be doing to the puppet. Or what I what do you mean? He could be committing acts of sodomy yeah. or something on the puppet. Or having other people. Oh, <laughs> I mean, the puppet, puppet could be used in satanic ritual. Yeah. Seriously, the way Fred works that puppet, I'm, I feel like he's a son. Let's see it. Just, just give it back. I can't what people oh, might can't give do it back. It. I can't get it. I went through a lot of trouble to get that puppet. Where do you live now? I mean, what state are you in? I'm in New Jersey. Come on, drive it in here. Be a hero. Yeah, I'm, only, I'm only 15 minutes from you. You could have I the Gary have puppet here. here. I can have it there in 15 minutes for the right price. I All right, it. we'll come up with the money. You come in with the puppet. I knew I should have put Lojack in the puppet. Yeah. <laughs> Gary, you oh, make, make jokes. Make jokes. Oh, yeah, make jokes. Gary, Gary, you made it so easy. What, what was... I couldn't understand it. I was sitting there thinking, how could I... I was actually thinking, maybe I should take this puppet. You know what it is? Because when you're stupid, you trust everyone. Yeah. It's like Forrest Gump. Maybe Tom. You want the puppet? Maybe well, Tom will offer him something from the station. Forget Tom. Well, Tom doesn't have to. This is Tom, my this responsibility. Is a, this is Gary's response. Tom, I don't think Tom has to offer. Tom doesn't have to offer anything. Tom's very cheap. <laughs> Tom, I know. I, I can just tell us the Tom bottom has line. No love for the puppet. I can he hear no Tom running down the hall now. Tell us what you want. Oh, here he is. <laughs> Tom, you believe this? Tom's not very cheap, but he's not going to negotiate with a ransomer. He'd but it's Gary, Gary Puppet. Puppet. If Gary Puppet's Puppet. like a child oh, to me. Did you get the <laughs> if you had a child that was kidnapped, wouldn't you <laughs> negotiate? But we have a lead. I, I don't know why we haven't called this into the police. I don't know why we this haven't. Yeah, we could be tracing this call. Felony. You committed a felony, sir. Just That's drive down here and all be forgotten. Exactly. No questions asked. Just turn in the Gary Puppet. Nah, I'd rather, I'd rather keep the puppet. Okay, no problem, because we'll are gonna call a local precinct and we'll report the uh, there license you go. plate and, get, and get this thing in gear right now. The car was stolen. It doesn't matter. Oh, Oh, right, no please. problem. Yeah, you, you <laughs> stole a car to lift a puppet? <laughs> you weren't even lifting a puppet. What are you, Dillinger? All I know is, ladies and gentlemen, you are now witnessing why my producer is the stupidest producer <laughs> in the country. He, I said to him, do not take that Gary puppet anywhere. And he says, Bull, don't, what are you worried about? I'll take the puppet. I'll uh, take care of it. I will, t- I will not load it out of my sight, and you let my Gary puppet out of sight. I know. And this what? puppet has spent... A w- where is it? Is it buried, the puppet? <laughs> what did you do with it all weekend? Can it breathe? I, I, slept, I slept with it all weekend. Oh, Oh, geez. that's disgusting. <laughs> the Gary puppet's like having a homosexual <laughs> liaison no, with this guy. No. Some hillbilly. Oh. And it loves Fred. Stop that. 
I don't like it leaving my office. I don't even like it leaving my office. Well, you know, as I, I, and this is it. No, 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 you'll never be to be building. trusted again. I see a movie here, Silence of the Gary Puppet. It's true, <laughs> it, but it's not yeah, funny. Yeah, he's in a pit. <laughs> <laughs> is it Sir, I want the Gary Puppet. I'll bring it down, I'll pay. What do you, what do you no, you don't have to pay. I'll Just pay. tell me how much it is. I want well, Gary to Give me a bottom line. No, 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 I'll pay. Well, no, how much I'll is pay it? for it. How much is it? I want my puppet back. Two thousand will do it. All right, get it down here. All right. Bastard. What did I tell well, you Well, how soon will you be here? Uh, well, I could be, I, I'm about 15 minutes. Well, well I, got, yeah, I just got, let me ask you I'm something. I'm in bed. I just got out of bed. You want to make a drop-off point or something? Yeah, yeah. Where Listen, do you want? They, <laughs> make a drop-off point. Should we send Gary? How am, I, how am I going to get the money? That's what I'm saying. I'll exchange, I'll, at the drop-off point, I'll leave the money, you leave the puppet. All right. This, uh, Gary can't <laughs> handle this. Gary's too stupid yeah, to handle it. Yeah, he'll lose the money and the puppet. Like, exactly. Let Gary do it. <laughs> I'll send Gary with Ronnie. <laughs> The exchange will happen. You know what's good? It's like Jack and the Beanstalk. I'll come back without the puppet and without the 2000 That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Gary will get ripped off twice. Tom is unbelievable. Uh, so where do you want to do, do, do the chicken? <laughs> you can't believe Gary's stupidity, right? No, I, I can't believe we lost the Gary puppet. That's, the, that's a big star. Not only is he a television star, but he's you a radio know how star. How important that was to the show. I heard he was. I heard there was a look rumor. Look at Tom. Look at Tom looking at Gary. <laughs> he can't no, believe it. Priceless. No, no, not at all. I no, can't wait for no. his next negotiation. <laughs> yeah. He's going to remember this. What is when it, Ralph? Gary's trying to get more money for two thousand. I'll make a new one. Exactly. No, but the point is, I want it back today. I got to yeah. wait four weeks. No, I can. You want it. the Gary puppet living with this guy? <laughs> How, does anybody here care about the Gary He'll puppet? Be... I don't care about the puppet. And you want him running around with the original, and, and then he'll, he'll do something with it. He'll have it at card shows, and yeah. he'll, yeah, make it, a, he'll keep, be making money. But of course, if it keeps, turning, think, if it keeps hey, turning up, people will report him. I mean, the guy stole it. It's a he felony. the original back. I can't believe that can be duplicated. It's too great. That's, That's what I mean. You guys have to get another. You know Remember, I had the double O zeros make that song for right. me. H O W A R D, and then they made they the second. To prove it. They, right. they tried right. to prove it. But I like say, the original. Didn't you say you wanted a tongue on it and a couple Even of other modifications? Even if we get a new one, we need the original for the archives to as show well. the evolution of Gary. That's I right. Understand. <laughs> well, we've got video. And then I got to wait a month for the damn puppet. <laughs> you don't believe this. I know. Tom's having a ball. Hey, where's this the puppet right now? I'm best screw up. Is the puppet okay? Yeah, it's, it's in my bed. Right Let now. me you talk to him. You haven't broken it in any way. No, Let me talk to him. The, pup, the, pup, the puppet's the very puppet. fragile. <laughs> Let me talk to him for a minute. Hey, yo, what are you doing? Gary Puppet, you okay? Fine. The guy's feeding you? Yeah, he's, really well. He's treating Is he you, treating you okay? <laughs> yeah, great. <laughs> <laughs> I am licking my lips like a madman. <laughs> Didn't I tell you last week how Gary delegates everything? Yeah. Well, this is another example. I'm gonna. I don't know what to do about this. What should I do? You're a management I, guy. I think we should go after this guy. I mean, yeah, but what about him? What about us getting the puppet back? I think the key is to get the puppet back first and then to deal with me later. Seriously, what, why get me now? We got to no, get the puppet back. No, but you know, it seems trivial. But if you gave, if you entrusted Gary with something very important, and then he didn't come through, what do you do to punish him? Yeah, it would depend on what it was. You fired people for less, right? Now, Howard, wait a second. We should remember that I'm the... Now, I know it's your property. I finally have a reason to fire Wait a second. Him. Wait a minute. I, what is Tom saying? You no. don't fire somebody for lo losing, losing a station crucial property? piece of equipment? I would say it would depend on what they did. Th well, that's what I'm asking. You, a crucial if you piece told of the person, value. If you told the person... To watch the puppet and keep it in his hands the entire weekend. If you weekend. take it, you're responsible Didn't for Didn't I say it. that to you? Wait a second. I yes, can, I, 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 give, I heard you, it. Yes, I of course you did. you did. I can give you an example. Somebody once almost ruined the board, which is very expensive. Yeah. And Tom right. did not fire that person. Who was that person? I don't want to say because it's not fair. They got fired the next week. No, they didn't. <laughs> yeah. I bet you they're not here Tom anymore. Tom was very they upset. Are. So they, upset they, that we heard that yeah. he wanted to fire the person, but he didn't. I was here until 3 o'clock. What happened? They spilled something they on spilled, it? They spilled 10K. It's like that running drink. You know, oh, it's like, big deal. That's a like Gatorade. Oh, he, that's good see, for it. You should see the smoke coming out of the board. But the guy didn't do it on purpose. I told you to keep I didn't your do hand it on, on that puppet. I but the, didn't do it it's on a, it's a form, You know what it is? I'm going to tell you what it is. It's psychological with you. You hate the Gary puppet. I don't hate the Gary puppet. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> no, I don't. You hate him, and hey, you took him, and I can be an accessory to a kidnapping. Hold on a second. Howard, let me explain. It's that way on a conscious level. Wait, hold on, hold on. That puppet irks you because it makes fun of you. Can I say something? It does. Oh, Howard. So what do you think? So no, why right. does he leave the puppet? If it was his wife's engagement ring, he wouldn't have left it Howard, behind I the counter. Howard, that. listen to me. Do you agree with that? I agree with that. Yeah. Howard, listen to me. The puppet. Was who had the court. puppet for a year? For six I, months. Uh, who had it? Who had the puppet? Yes, who had it? Kevin. No, who had it for six months after Kevin? 
I don't know who did. I did. Yeah, but yeah. they didn't make the, fun who, of you. Who told you the puppet existed? Who offered to bring it in? Of course, I knew you guys were going to make fun of me with the puppet. One day, Howard said, "This is exactly how it went." I don't think you realize no, how no. long it would last and how Howard, big a star. No, no, Howard no, said the Gary puppet eclipsed you in fame. The Hold Gary on. puppet is more popular and a better producer than you. He's not getting and paid for can... appearances. He can do whatever he wants. Listen, Howard said, "I'd love to." Why did to you do have to pu- bring him? Did Howard they said, hired you? Howard they said, bring- "I'd love to bring a puppet on the show," and I said, "You know what, Howard? There's a puppet of me at home from the channel." Uh, yeah, and why didn't you? I'll tell bring me? it in. And why didn't you tell me about the puppet six months ago? Because I didn't why know you'd did be you interested wait? in. Oh, it. I wouldn't be interested well, in my own puppet. My my property that yeah, you are holding. What were you doing? Holding on to it. What were you holding onto my puppet for? I didn't. Know I want to know that you have my puppet. I want to know that that was my puppet. Why did you have it for six months? Because it is mine. I came up with the concept and had it made. Just because it cut your face doesn't make it yours. It's not your puppet. (laughs) It was not your puppet. It wasn't anybody's puppet. I should have known six months ago. It's not my puppet and it's not your puppet. And now I'm (laughs) negotiating with a a, a kidnapper. You know what? You're right. It's not our puppet. It's that guy's puppet on the phone. And why wasn't I told about the Gary puppet being missing immediately? I would have called the police immediately. Well, I wanted to wait till Monday. I had the plate number. Well, who asked you? It's my property. To let the trail get cold. That's the tip. Yeah. Gary there was Miller. no trail to get I want to make sure the, ta- the trail gets cold. <laughs> and the Gary, right, the Gary right. puppet could have been here right now, safe and sound. How? Right. How? Or it could be because out. the cops could have tracked him down over the weekend. You had a license number. Yes, I did. Ugh. Yes, I did. So You've mishandled this entire well, thing. Let's get this the, entire episode. Let's, uh, this is worse than your 911 call. Hey, Gary, did, did they get a description of the car? Yes, they did. What kind of car was it? I am not going to say to you. Big. Uh, well, it's a big car, Bolf. Big. <laughs> I have the eyewitness. If, you know, the, but how, why wouldn't you call? The, why would you call me and tell me? Because this is Gary. And why six months ago didn't he tell me he had Gary. the Gary? Why puppet? would I call you? Because it is my how, puppet. Sh- it is my puppet. Helena, why would I call you on Sunday to tell you about it? What could because you have I, done? If you told me you had a license, I would have said, "Give me the number. I'll call the police and have mm-hmm. them track it down." Now the trail is cold. Gary yeah, doesn't know what you do with a license could be in number. Iowa now. Well, yeah, the puppet, the puppet could be in another state. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what to do with a license number, Bull? Bull, well, how could you get the puppet back over the weekend? Uh, the cops don't work on the weekend. This is as bad as I thought the it would be. The cops go to the beach. This is as bad as Bull, I thought it would be. Are the cops open on Sunday, Bull? Bull, wait a second. <laughs> I should call the cops now. But well, why don't we get this back? It's, it's a weekend. Why don't we? Why don't we finish this negotiation and let's get it back? Look at the position you've put me but, in. Why don't Number we, one, you betrayed my trust. How? Why don't you we had get the Gary puppet, puppet back for six now, months, and, and then I'm we'll right. yell about it later? You hate the Gary puppet. I don't hate the Gary puppet. I love the Gary. You puppet. You lost it, and you didn't even call anybody. I see made-for-TV movies. I say you intentionally took the Gary puppet to your appearance, hoping someone would steal it. Why else would you leave it? Not true. And you know that I'm too nice a guy to fire in you. In fact, I th- I was thinking to myself in the middle of the appearance that this is the last time I'm ever. We're going to bring the puppet out because it's too fragile to make appearances. Oh, boy. You know, I wouldn't mind if Gary had a special puppet made for appearances uh-huh. and out of his own money. But don't take my puppet that has become a bigger star than you and certainly a bigger star than Fred himself and maybe, finally gave Fred something to do on maybe, the show. Maybe as big a now star. Now Fred as has nothing to do. I wouldn't say bigger. Maybe as big. Now Fred has to sit around and worthless. Fred is useless again. <laughs> yeah. oh, no. Fred, are you all right over there? I know you worked in Gary Puppet. Oh, You're pretty close to it. His hand know. is lovely. Yeah, pretend. <laughs> pretend he's here. I can't even make jokes about it. Are you serious? He's hurt. Oh. <laughs> I was surprised he's been quiet. I, mean, I didn't even time. want the E guys taking that thing because they were doing some stuff with it. And right. I told him, it's like told him to be careful. Hey, hey he's, got, he's got a slight crack on him. Oh, man. Don't, what don't did you do? Care. You didn't no, crack him, did you? It was already there. A little crack by the neck. There was no crack. No, there was a little, little hairline. I, I, I didn't do it. It was already there. Well, are you beating the puppet, Let's just Gary? get the puppet no back crack. already. Howard, I was thinking, you got a large following. I could probably get a lot more for it than that, at 2000 okay. I could this probably get about 5000 for it. Now that I think I'm not about giving it, you 5000 I think I'm going to have to keep it then. I think I think I could get at least 5000 I had people offer me at least 2000 That's why I said that. Well, I think we'll just call the cops now. All right. Yeah, yeah. now that now that it's three days later. <laughs> when did you now do you're going to have to run with the Do you think his car is going somewhere? I don't know. I don't know. You think He'll run away. Now. So let him run away. We we call the cops. Yeah, the cops. We'll put out an APB. Yeah, that's going to be great when you <laughs> call the cop. cops. Don't have anything better to do than go chase a puppet. What do you say? Uh, I lost my puppet. <laughs> <laughs> well, luckily we have fa- we have police. Us. Wait a second. We've been very nice to the police over that's the right. years, and they're fans of the show, and they understand the gravity of the situation. Gary, you don't understand gravity. How, <laughs> I don't need to. How are you going to explain it to the cops? I know the apple hit me in the head when I sat under the feet, tree. When I pick up my foot, it touches the ground again. Tom, here's what I'm saying. Okay. <sighs> I'm asking you as my manager, my right. general manager. When an employee takes something 
and maliciously loses it because Wait I have a given second. Malicious, is, malicious is in dispute. He held on to the puppet malicious for six is, months. Is in dispute. Never told me about it. Well, see, I would say if there was intent, then that would. But I don't think there was intent here. That Gary doesn't intend to do no. anything. No, I don't think Gary intended to lose the puppet. <laughs> intend to think. How could you not call the cops? Yeah, that, about the my, how could you not call you, and tell you, me you that my puppet You should have called shot? Howard immediately. I wanted to wait. I didn't. Want, I was afraid to call Howard. I was. Did afraid you call to, anyone? Did I call anyone? No. 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 You didn't call the puppet police? No, I didn't call the puppet oh. police. Oh, God. <laughs> Tom, it's real funny. I'm sorry. Puppet police. <laughs> if anything happens to that Gary puppet, I want it back, sir. Well, are you willing to pay the 5000 Come on, be reasonable. No. That's not reasonable. That's the, now you, now that's you're being, the original puppet. Come that's, on, you're a fan like of the show. That's the original Charlie McCarthy doll. Well, what's he going to do with it? People He's going to sell that, it to somebody people else? People love that puppet. You should not see the reaction you. I get. That's the, they didn't believe me, actually, it was the real puppet. Now they're going to believe me, which gives it a lot more, uh, you know, makes it look legit now. How about $2,000 and 10 uh, autographed private parts? Yeah. No, I already got the book. No, 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 but they're uh, autographed. They're worth like $500,000 And I'll throw in the new paperback. Yeah. With uh, 64 new pages. Well, I Autographed. Gotta, I don't know. I don't know. i got to think about That's it. That's worth maybe. way more than a puppet. Maybe I'll have to call you, you back. Down. I don't know. Right. He's shaking me down. This is like Jackie in a negotiation. We're going to get the police in here. <laughs> you want plugs? <laughs> you want plugs? I'll give you a plug every day on the show for appearances. <laughs> you know what those are worth? <laughs> Thousands of dollars each plug. I have to see every plug. <laughs> and Robin will sleep with you. <laughs> please. Oh, I'll do it for free then. <laughs> Robin, bail me out. Ah, please. It'll I be didn't good. Lose any it'll be good for you. Things. It'll be good for him. <laughs> Gary, do me a favor. What's you that? Take this guy off the air, and you'll try and will arrange you a drop-off point and negotiate a price. Pay, pay what's reasonable. And get the puppet back today. You got a uh, number? What's that? Do you have a number? What did you write down? Nothing. You I just oh. wrote something down to remind me to do right. something. Yeah, to negotiate for the puppet. Does everyone believe that this guy actually has the puppet? He sounds like it. He knew where, uh, about crazy. the door. He knew what the puppet was wearing. What's it got by its neck? What What's that? It got by its What's neck? it got by its neck? Right in front of the neck. What's it got? I don't know. Yeah. What I, I don't know. I'm, I'm sure against not. paying this guy anything personally. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you everything about it. I even shook Gary's hand before I took it. <laughs> <laughs> that was nice. Wash. Guy's a crook. He is. I say we don't pay. I we kissed the Gary Puppet goodbye. Puppet? Hold on, okay? Yep. All right, I got to take a commercial break. I got to think this through. All right. Still put All right it, hold on. Should put on. Yeah. Hold on. All right. All right I'm going to take a break. I want to talk to everyone about this. Hey, Howard. There's a cop outside. Really? Yeah, he wants to help out. Okay, no get kidding. It. John, go talk to him. You guys are fucking me, man. I could smell it a mile away. I could smell it. I, want to know something? I am so not fucking with you. Are you so are. You so are. I'm not. Why is I'm Ganji not. in here now? What are you doing this in here? Is funny. Yeah, turn that off. Seriously. Forget it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see his face. He's going to sneak up He's going to go, I know it. I knew it. I'm it all the time. Like you guys can't fool me. me. For howdy doody. Howdy doody. So, Gary, Did you call the police? Yeah. How was your experience? Oh, it's very good. I think I'm going to get the $1,500 out of Gary, though. <laughs> Are you going to give him up? Knock, knock. Who's there? April Fool. <laughs> let, me, let, me get in the, let me get in the control room before you do that. Okay. In case you're just tuning in, we're in the middle of a problem, slight problem. I really do want to resolve this one way or the other. I uh, talked it over. We are not going to pay any ransom for the Gary puppet. No. You're not? Well, I don't know. The guy hung up, first of all. We can't oh, get really? him back. That's number one. And there's a cop down here who says he's going to help us catch the thief. We're yeah, I saw a police officer outside. We're going to try to trace the plate, which... Good. You gave it to him and everything? I'm going to give it to him right now. He just glanced at it briefly. Yeah, well, don't uh, don't say it over the air in case it's right. not... And the, the witness guy is on the phone. What witness? The guy that saw everything. Oh. Well, why don't we get the cop in here, too? Okay. While the witness... We're looking at a witness and a cop. Yeah, you can take a report. Bubba New Boys York City police officer, though. New York City police officer. Hey, officer. If you're a, if you're a New York City officer, that doesn't mean... That means... The crime was committed in crime New Jersey. Crime was committed in Jersey. 
Do we have to contact the Jersey police? It's got to be reported in Jersey, right? It's got to be reported in Jersey. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Yeah. You believe how stupid he is? In today's day and age, Gary is as stupid as a wall. This is what I, my point is. Forget about, officer, the fact that he's got to be a little street smart. Forrest Gump laughs at Gary. No, I understand that, but what you should have done is told this guy to come in and arrange a drop-off point. And then we could have nailed him. Well, we could have persuaded him to give it back to uh, Gary. He'll call back. Jay, we'll make our own puppet. All right. Well, if Unfortunately, a bit of history for the show has been lost. But Right. All right. A little, little bit of show history yeah. is lost. That's yeah. all. Well, we don't have, we can't. All right, Gary, you'll talk to the officer after the show. Okay. All right. Thank you, officer. All right. Thank you. Gary, you idiot. The, the officer probably wants to say you're an idiot, but that's uh, he can't He's say it. He's too nice. He's too nice. too nice a guy. I know it's not much, but do you think seeing a couple of women nude would help a little bit? I want you to repeat after me. That would help. Okay. Maybe you'll learn your lesson. I, I am more, am more irresponsible, irresponsible than myself. Than myself. I pulled... I pulled a bigger boner, a bigger boner than any porno star. Than any porno star. I will never, ever, ever again take Wolfie's stuff and give it away again. I will never, ever, ever again take Wolfie's stuff and give it away again. I didn't give it away. But I, I will stop taking overdoses. I will stop taking overdoses of stupid pills and dumb capsules. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you learn. Of stupid pills and dumb capsules. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. I can't believe he did that. I mean, the very thing he was told not to do. He lost my puppet. Yeah. He was told to make sure that puppet came back in one piece. When I heard his sweet little voice over the phone. Oh. It made me, it made me crazy. He talked pretty well with a gag in his mouth. He did. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wouldn't be the first time you got fooled. Wouldn't be the last. No. You and Peter Jennings. Right. <laughs> there are morons like this on both coasts. <sighs> oh, well. No Gary Puppet. All right. Let's uh, finalize this discussion. Where were you appearing? You want the name? Yeah. A place called Film and Music in, uh, in Little Falls, New Jersey. It's and they do car stereos? Everything. They sell home systems, car stereos, laser discs, the whole deal. And we have the witness on the phone. Yeah, we also have uh, the manager of the place on the phone. <laughs> yeah, the manager of the place, if you want to... I'll he, put he both could, guys on. The manager of the place is good because he could just tell you how upset I was. And how I cursed at everyone in the store. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Howard? Is this the witness or the manager? This is the owner. Oh, the owner? Yeah. This is Nick? This is me. So you saw everything that happened? Well, I'm You were the guy who brought Gary out to the car with, when the Gary puppet was stolen? That's correct. Why did you need him to see your car so bad? Well, we brought him outside so he could uh, demonstrate the mini disc, which is why we were, why he was there. And why did you suggest that he leave the puppet there, or he just did it on his own? No, the puppet was sitting behind the counter uh, in the middle of the store. I had said to there was a woman working in the store with three sisters, just and I said, an eye on I said, it. would you please keep an eye on the puppet? She said yes. Mm -hmm. Well, well, you really I shouldn't left them. it. You shouldn't left it up to them. And You're what right. and what well, did they I say? I asked them. You know, we did have a lot of people in the store and. You know, we were trying to sell our audio and video equipment, and somebody uh, took their eyes off the puppet, not realizing... Was Gary freaking out at least? Excuse me? Was Gary freaking out at least? Oh, uh, you could say that. He was uh, very visually upset. Uh, it did bring it down a little bit, but... Uh, but that was like a funeral after that. <laughs> the store was full, and then everyone just stood around looking at me. The world's you biggest need... idiot. Well, then you did a good appearance. <laughs> at least there's something <laughs> to you talk did about. something it, for a we're, I'm telling you, it happened at about... The appearance was from 3 to 5. It happened at about... 4.30, 4.35. Yeah. I went back into the store, and, and everybody was standing around looking at me, and then some guy goes, man, it's like a funeral in here. Because you were so upset about the oh, puppet? Oh, yeah. And but everyone... you still had to stay there and Oh, yeah. Autograph. I had to do the final drawing for Eagles tickets. <laughs> I stayed till 5 o'clock. Yeah, he was not too happy towards the end. There. Were people asking for the Gary puppet? Yeah, well... It's well, one puppet. guy came in. Well, certainly, if you, if you get a hold of uh, listeners to put out the call, if you want for the e-show... I know for a fact that uh, that there's some very good videotape of me flipping out. Oh, really? Yeah. Someone took a puppet put in the back. Do you know where it is? Oh, yeah, they put it. Hold on a second. I just gotta find out where the puppet is. Hold on a second. 
I just wanted somebody to put the puppet in the back, you know where it is? Right after the whole thing happened, a guy came in who had a, a camera, and he goes, hey, where's the puppet? Uh, <laughs> you know, you, know, you lost it. I want to see that tape. Yeah. If that guy's out there, I want to see that tape. Howard. I need to see that. I want to know at least you suffered. I did. Yeah. Uh, during, during the appearance, I heard people in the audience going, man, we should steal the puppet. We should steal the puppet, which did, you know, should have alerted me to uh, the fact that there is some value to, the, uh, to this puppet. And but. we should not let it out of uh, the building. Yeah, yeah. The puppet's yeah. really popular. Yeah. It was pretty popular. It's like Charlie McCarthy getting lifted. Mm -hmm. and, or uh, Howdy Doody. I or Howdy to Doody. <laughs> Did you call the police? I offered to call the police. I asked Gary, let's call the police. If there's a value to this, let's call the Why police. Why didn't you call I, the I said, police? Because I was yeah, so Gary, upset, and I started yelling, and I said, I go, this is ridiculous. The cops don't care about a puppet. They have more important things to do. Yeah, but but it's a, it's a theft. Right, and you could still report it. It wasn't going to be any different. I mean, the cops... It's just like shoplifting. Right. Yeah. Why, why wouldn't you report it? I don't get you. You can report it at any time. There was you nothing they could have done. You probably found the person right away. No. Because you could have had it here, and I wouldn't have even known about it. Yeah. I don't understand you. Because, because maybe now he has the puppet. It's all broken up or something. I did not think that calling the police was going to do anything. I just It sounded stupid at the time. Why don't you just stop it? I did not think. Right. What is it, John? I got to be honest. Well, Gary thinks that you're acting. <laughs> yeah, it's tough. Really? Yeah, he still, he, he still thinks that. Think what you want. I don't have the puppet. Think what you want, my friend. Okay. He made a point of telling me, too, if this is part of a big gag, he was not going to be very amused with me. I did say that. I did say that. Well, will you, are you willing to swear that uh, you are not part of any gag? Well, you know what, Howard? Here's, here's the weird part. Now, here's, here's a guy that's got this big audio store, right? Right. In his stock room are, you know, video, video VCRs and laser displays stocked to the ceiling. Yeah. The back door of his place is open and anybody could walk in and out. A guy with all that electronic equipment doesn't think to keep that door locked. Oh, so you're blaming him for the garage? No, well, I'm just saying. Well, so it's just, I don't know how he runs he, he his did store. Mention that at the store, Howard. He I, was uh, asking me to visually give him an, an inspection of the place and how this could possibly have been done. So he's um, accusing you of doing no, it? No, no, I'm not accusing him at all. He wasn't I, accusing me, but he was probably trying to make me feel a little... Uh, little uh, responsible. No, I was just trying to figure out if this were a practical joke. How, in other words, how does a guy, but how does a guy leave his back door open with all electronic equipment and a store full of people a busy day? How does that happen? None of that was stolen. Exactly. Except yeah, for the Gary Puppet. Stolen. Yeah, I'm surprised because, you know, there are things of more value than $600, and I was pretty shocked myself that uh, somebody would really want to take that puppet. All right, well, thanks for calling. All right. I, was Gary crying? He was, uh, I was very, not, very upset. I was not crying. I was yelling. I said the he F was, word a lot. He was down. He was really down. Well, at least he was upset, because he sure I doesn't said, seem upset to me now. I Thank said, you. Well, you could see the tape of it. Put this to rest now. The Gary puppet is officially gone. So you don't want to talk to Let's the witness there. anymore. Hold a second. Someone's here. Knock, knock. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey, look, it's the Gary oh. puppet. Oh. Give it to $7, Gary. Oh. Hold on. Yeah, I saw you writing that down. 718. You know, I said it's a joke. 718. I know you set me up. No, you, you, guys. Didn't. you didn't know anything. Oh. The Gary Puppet, is this something you want to say? Yeah, take the $1,500 and buy yourself a friggin' brain. <laughs> <laughs> 
There he is, Gary Puppet. You think I'd be stupid enough to let that puppet out of my sight with you? Yeah. Uh, just we charge? knew you'd lose it. Can, can you just give me a, a rough estimate of the scope All of right. how far this goes? We were we were plotting the stealing of the Gary Puppet for three weeks. <laughs> right. But could you tell Was me? it over three weeks? Three weeks, I would say. About three weeks. About three weeks. Me? I, I mean, we plotted it, but we thought it was going to be that weekend, the appearance. We didn't realize it was yeah, so we far had away. Yeah, okay, yeah. let me let me put we, a few this things. This is what happened. Gary came in about three weeks ago and asked me if he could bring the Gary puppet. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I did say to him, how oh, he was calling me all weekend freaking out. Was he? Oh, did you know? I, know, I, know, I stole, he it. stole it. John stole it. I don't you know didn't even know John stole it. <laughs> and, and he kept calling John, which is funny. <laughs> and John and I were on the phone all weekend. We're laughing our heads off. Yeah, and you didn't tape any of that? John and I had the funniest oh, phone call man. all weekend. You didn't tape you any of You should have taped uh, Gary freaking out. I, know, I, left I, know, two I left two messages on his machine. One of them was John. You got to call One of them I still have. It's really important. Well, anyway, listen to this. Oh, man. So John calls me at night and he goes, we got the Gary puppet. <laughs> I go, you know what you got to do? You got to tell your friend just to drop off a shoe. <laughs> and like, you know, like, like leave it in the garbage. Right, for real. Yeah, cut funny, the, sh the shoe kept falling off. Yeah, so anyway, so anyway um, what happened was like three weeks ago, Gary came to me and said he wants to take the Gary puppet too. And I, and I really did say to him, this was before we started plotting it, I just said, don't lose the stupid That's puppet. Right. You can take it, but you have to Because we love the it. damn thing. I said, I don't care if you take it as long as you... You know, you're responsible for it. So, of course, everyone starts going after and that lecture. And he did a real good job of keeping an eye on me, too. <laughs> <laughs> John, is, it, is this your license plate? Was it your car? It was my assistant's car. Is that the plate? I, oh, I, yeah. no, I don't think so. No, I don't even think you had the right plate. I actually, actually, I'll admit now that I uh, I called it into a friend of mine who's a cop, and, and it came back... Uh, that it was the wrong plate. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. You know what? I had a sneaking suspicion that Gary didn't have a license plate. Yeah. No, I didn't know I had a plate, and I did call it in, but I wasn't going to tell he was anybody. It was a dinner plate. Yeah. Okay, who is the guy on the a phone? Dinner plate. The guy, who's That's the, John's friend. The guy on the phone is the actual guy who took it. The actual he's 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 a friend of my assistant's, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and I, his name is Paul Lauer. Right. And uh, he uh, he was great. He wanted to just grab it and run out of the store, but. You know, you know, he didn't care about getting you know beat up or anything. He was like to do it. How are you feeling, Gary Puppet? August Fool, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I would have been better off with a kidnapper than in John Smelly apartment, though. <laughs> anyway, I wouldn't I still smelled it? So anyway, here's the point. So afterwards, Gary, you know, so Gary leaves the room, and we decide, okay, we're going to steal the stupid Gary yeah. Puppet from the appearance. But we can't figure out how we're going to do it. I thought the guys were going to first just steal it from the back office so Gary couldn't find it, but that wouldn't make sense. No, it had to be had under to Gary's be... care. It had to be out there yeah. in the public. In Gary's and charge. I said, there's no way that we're going to be able to get the puppet away from him. So we got the owner in cahoots. Yeah. And I said, all he's got to do is pull Gary away for two seconds. I cannot believe. This is, I cannot believe that the owner of that store and everybody that worked in that store could watch me be as upset as I was, which and is pretty leave upset. You that way. And leave me that way and not <laughs> Gary, do anything guy, about it. The owner told me that at if one point he was going to break down because Gary was almost crying. But no, no, I said to the guy, I'll tell you when I got to the guy, how I, how, what, some of the things that tipped me off a little bit. <laughs> right. Of course, you never know right. until the last minute. One of the things that tipped me off was I was so upset. Now, that's I entertainment, just, watching Gary I get so upset. upset. I, I, I turned around. Hey, if anyone, do they have a videotape of it? I don't know. Somebody shot a video. Please, tape. if you have a videotape, I need Please it for tonight's TV show. Yeah, I thought, I, I, I genuinely yeah. thought you sent those guys in when I was trying to piece this together. Yeah. I genuinely thought you sent those guys in to tape me being upset so you'd have it for the E-show. No, we weren't that smart <laughs> about it. But at one point, I was in there with the two owners, and I just said to them, I said, well, thanks a lot. I go, now the whole world will know that I'm the biggest a-hole in the world. I go, everybody already thinks I'm a moron. Now you guys can help me prove it. <laughs> right. And then they go... They, they don't even know me. And they go, no, 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 Gary. Everybody knows you're a smart guy. You know? <laughs> you're right. I said, wait, these guys are being too nice. Yeah, you all should fucking die. Hey, Gary, you glad it's over? Of course I'm glad it's over. Yeah. But they had a guy call up. Who, you won't watch it on the we'll E-shirt. They had a guy call up who so said he had it. He described it exactly right, how he got it. And then he wanted like a... I suppose. Well, yeah, yeah. I, I mean, it was semi believable. Yeah, I mean, I thought they were in on it, but you never know. Then he's like, he wanted a thousand for it. Then he's like, you know, screw that. I could probably get big money for it. Everybody. I mean, he was good. It's pretty good. And then the owner called in. I sort of had a feeling. I mean, but you never know until you know. Such a dick. Ganji's fucking tape. How long have you been standing behind me, you cunt? Five minutes. Fucking asshole. Everett is an asshole. Get what I want. Yeah. Who's that, Mary? Yeah. She's still mad at me? Yeah. She's as good as her. Hold on. I'll do that show. I tell you, you know what? I might back you. I'm going to be there. And you get hurt. He's in a fan. Tell John what an asshole you think he is. You're double asshole. Oh, Mary. Why? Ruined my weekend. How was he all weekend? It was terrible. I was worried about poor little Gary. What was he saying? Not this little Gary. Little Gary that got abducted. Oh. When I was.
was going to, when, when we went to bed at night, yeah. you know the underdog song? I was singing, oh, where, oh, where is the Gary and that? Oh, where, oh, where could he be? What did you tell him to uh, comfort him there? Did I tell him to comfort him? Yeah. Mm, it was more important than a stupid uh, puppet. Did you think it was a scam or did you? I thought it was a scam. Yeah? When he walked in the door, his face was so worried. I could tell right away. I'm like, what's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> I felt so bad. I, I'm telling you, it was, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was probably the meanest thing that I've ever done. Really? Yeah, I really felt bad. Because <laughs> uh, I mean, every, cause I, because I sent my other friend to go in and see how Gary was taking it. She said he was like, he looked like he was going to cry. Uh, <laughs> I said, yeah. you know, I said, Gary's a little, I, you know, I said, Gary's a little, so I, so my best friend's on the show, like, and, he's, and, and we become so close, I felt so bad. <laughs> How bummed out was I all weekend? You were so bummed out. It was like, we kind of keep, you know, we would do something fun, and then we would start talking about it, you know. It was a wreck. Well, you know, I tell you, you better, when your baby's born, you better not you know, leave it alone with Gary. I know. <laughs> when he left the house, I'm like, take a care of him. <laughs>